Family of Dia Abrams, who went missing nine months ago from her ranch near Idlewild, is asking a judge to remove the current trustees of her estate. As News 8's David Gonfredson reports, the court petition targets the man claiming to be Abrams' fiance, as well as another woman who both have been managing the properties. I feel saddened that the children are actually going to that extent. The son and daughter of Dia Abrams, a former La Jolla millionaire who mysteriously went missing in June from her ranch near Idlewild, are now taking action in court. The petition filed this week seeks removal of the two current trustees of the estate, Keith Harper and Diana Fetter. But Fetter tells News 8 the missing woman didn't want her adult children involved in her properties. She made me promise, as well as several other people, that the children would not be allowed in the home because the first thing that would happen if she was gone, that they would come in and take everything. The man currently running the ranch, Keith Harper, claims to be Abrams' fiancé, and he co-manages the ranch with Fetter. Harper was the last person to see Abrams on the day she went missing, and he has filed power of attorney over the estate. Harper is power of attorney. I am not. I do not get to make decisions. I am the secondary if he is removed. The petition filed by Clinton and Chrisara Abrams alleges, quote, the Riverside Sheriff's Department is investigating Mr. Harper as a potential perpetrator of the crime or crimes that led to Abrams' disappearance, and that Ms. Fetter and Mr. Harper have been romantically involved since the beginning of their relationship. That is a completely false allegation. I only met him twice, and I had not spoken to him again until I was told of her disappearance. And... I would definitely not be involved with Harper in that, one, he is at least 25 years my senior, <laughs> and we cannot even be considered friends. The petition also says mortgage payments are in default on the 117-acre Bonita Vista Ranch where Abrams lived, and the Abrams family alleges Harper has not provided any accounting of the assets. Quote, Abrams had nearly $200,000 and some jewelry in a safe deposit box. She also owned many valuable guns. Any authority Mr. Harper has to access these and other assets should be suspended immediately. And what's your opinion of Harper and what do you believe about his possible involvement in Dia's disappearance? I don't know Harper. Um, as far as I'm concerned, I'm not ruling anything out. I do not rule Harper out. I do not rule her children out. Keith Harper did not respond to messages seeking comment for this report. In the petition, the Abrams children are asking a judge to appoint a independent professional fiduciary to oversee the estate. Carla? This is another layer to this whole mystery and disappearance. What about the police investigation into Abrams' disappearance? Do we have any update right now on the search for her? Uh, no, no updates. We reached out to Riverside uh, Sheriff's Department and asked what's going on with their missing persons case, and they did not respond to our messages. The court hearing on this probate petition filed by the Abrams kids is now set for May 13th in court in Palm Springs. All right, David Gofferton reporting live. Thanks, David.